Iron Supporting Food Banks collects food and cash donations for needy families in Newham Borough and beyond. Please consider making a donation via their Just Giving page, the link for which you will find in the description section of this stream. Come on you Irons! Hello, welcome once again to the West Ham Massive. Thanks for joining me and please don't forget to like, comment on and share this stream to your social media platforms and subscribe to our YouTube channel if you haven't done so already and make sure you hit the bell icon for alerts of new content. All these actions you can take are free of charge to you. They take a couple of seconds and they help to grow the channel from where we find ourselves at the moment. Thank you very much indeed for your support and you're probably all sitting there wondering why I'm dressed up in this finery it's not a court appearance or anything like that my son is actually having his university graduation today so i'll be going over to the university of east london where we'll be getting his his mortar board and scroll he got a first in accounting and business finance or whatever it was can't remember the bloody topic um but it's something to do with numbers it's something to do with money and hopefully he's gonna be able to make me retire a little bit early unless of course I win the Sky Sports Super Six this year and get all all six all six results right. So anyway, um, let's get down to it, ladies and gentlemen. Now I, I apologise as well because normally what I've done in the previous couple of weeks is I've done it this episode before the match week. Unfortunately, the way things went this week, I couldn't fit it in. So I'm doing it sort of after the fact, but, you know, I hope you'll appreciate that I'm getting this out there. Now, if you don't know what Sky Sports Super 6 is, um, basically it's a, a game, if you will, that is played through the Sky Sports platform. I'm just going to sort of get share my screen with you, ladies and gentlemen. So you can, those of you that are wondering what the hell I'm talking about, it will make a little bit more sense, I guess, if I actually show you what we're talking about so this is the website in question and what i'll also do for you is i'll just change the ticker at the bottom and i will put a link in the description below this particular video that if you want to sort of get involved you can do so now although we've already had three weeks of the super six just it isn't impossible for someone to win it now uh, i remember when i first played super six many years ago my brother invited me onto a league that had already been running for six weeks um, and I went and won that particular league so the fact that I had a six week disadvantage when it was all said and done actually didn't cost me so three weeks missed yes you're obviously behind you know behind the curve but that doesn't mean to say that if you've got the wind at your back and a little bit of luck that you couldn't retrieve it so what you want to do is you want to go on to super6.skysports.com forward slash league you're looking for the West Ham Massive League and your PIN number is all uppercase for the letters Echo Bravo 53 November 8. As I say, it'll be in, it's in the ticker on the bottom of your screen. And I will also put it in the description section below for your um, retrieval. So just to sort of like show you here now, the next round is round four. Uh, the deadline for which will be the 14th of September. We're obviously on an international break at the moment. So the next round is not until September the 14th and the deadline is 3 p.m. on that particular day. If we have a look at the West Ham Massive League, so currently there are, and I think if I remember correctly, if I just expand that out, yes, we've got 21 participants and top of the tree, as you can see there, of 41 points is some guy whose name escapes me. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, look, you know, a lot can change. There's a lot of lot of jockeying for position. It's it's still early days. So as I say, it's not too late for anybody to join and maybe make sort of like a move up the ladder very quickly. So basically, what you do, um, just to sort of show you, so you predict your score lines. Um, you can see here I've predicted the score lines for match week four, um, with Manchester City Brentford being a two nil to the home team. Same for the Liverpool Forest outcome. Same for the Villa Everton outcome. Bournemouth one, Chelsea two is what I've put down as a result. And the same again, the away team winning 2-1 I've put for the Tottenham Arsenal game. 
and again an away win for the uh well an away win for Newcastle it going to Wolves by the same scoreline. So you can see there. Now I may alter these. I can edit them as you can see right up to 3 p.m. on the 14th. So these aren't in tablets of stone. But what happens is, for those of you that don't know, so if I get the result correct, if not the scoreline, so say if Manchester City beat Brentford by three goals to nil, for instance, then for that I will get two points. If, however, for the Liverpool game, I managed to predict it completely bang on, and that is a 2-0 home win, then for that I will get five points. The points are tallied up over a match week, and obviously they're added to your cumulative score in the league. Now, as I say, we've obviously completed the month of August now. So, as I say, this is also the cumulative score for the season as well as the month. You obviously have got here, it breaks down the scores into by round, by month, by season. Obviously, there was only one month so far of the season, so the month is absolutely no different to the season. But if you can look on an individual round, and as you can see there for match week three, I managed to draw level with Fritz, who got 16 points. We both had pretty much exactly the same. We got three results correct, two scores correct for a total of 16 points. Stephen Dyke managed to get 14, Adam Miller 13, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. You can see there. So, yeah, that's basically the long and the short of it. Now, it's completely free to enter. All you need to do is you need to have a Skybet account, but you do not need to make a deposit. You do need to be over the age of 18, of course. And there are various prizes that you can win. Now, the big prize, and this is the one that really gets most people's attention. If in the event of you actually managing to predict all six score lines in a match week correctly, you will win £250,000. That's right. Quarter of a million pounds. Have I got your attention now? So you may have missed the last three weeks if you've not in got involved in this so far. But that doesn't mean to say it's not worth a bash. You could, you might not win the league, but if you actually got all six correct, quarter of a million pounds richer, thank you very much. So if you want any more information, as you can see here, you've got the more tab on the Super 6 website. You've got the frequently asked questions, which obviously gives you the answers to frequently asked questions. How do you play? Is it free to play? How do I register? How do I play head to head? Et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. You've also got the terms and conditions. Again, very important that you read these. And the most obvious one is that you need to be 18 years or over to play this competition. So that's basically it in a nutshell, ladies and gentlemen. So um, that's that's how you get involved. That's what you do. Um, if you want to have a little look at my own results for round 16, if anyone is actually interested just again as a demonstrator of how you play this game so i predicted aston villa would go to leicester and win 2-1 that was indeed the score five points again i predicted everton two sorry i predicted everton one bournemouth two and the score was actually everton two bournemouth three so although i got the result correct i didn't get the score line correct so for that i only got two points for the Nottingham Forest Wolves game, I predicted a 1-0 home win, but that was actually a 1-1 draw. So I don't get anything for that. In the Premier League, yeah, I, I did predict that we would lose. I was be I was using my, my head rather than my heart uh, in the West Ham Man City one. I predicted it would be 2-1 to Manchester City. And they ended up getting a, a scoreline that I said rather flat of them, in my opinion, 3-1. But So I did get, didn't get the scoreline right, but I got the correct result, two points. In the Premier League, I correctly predicted 2-1 to Newcastle against Spurs. That was five points for me. And obviously, the Manchester United-Liverpool game, I predicted 2-1 to the away team, and it was a 3-0 result. So, therefore, I got the two points. Now, there is also another little element to this. There's, uh, there's, two, well, there's two elements. You've got a golden goal prediction, which is the, first, the minute of the first goal scored in these six fixtures. I predicted the fourth minute. And it was actually in the 10th minute that Chris Wood got the first goal in these six particular fixtures. Also, you go against Jamie Carragher. Um, I actually beat Jamie in this round. That's quite pleasing, I've got to say. Jamie got six correct. Uh, he got, um, I got six points, excuse me, for correct results. Jamie only got two. 
We both got 10 points each for correct scores. So I win by a scoreline of 16 points to two. Never mind, Jamie. There's always next week that you can always try and get your own back on the old son. But never mind. Keep trying. But that's it, ladies and gentlemen. As I say, it's a, it's a little bit of fun. Um, you can win a nice little prize as well. Please do have a look on the, the frequently asked questions and the term and conditions if you're tempted to have a little go at this. And as I say, uh, if if that doesn't get your attention, then as I say, maybe winning a quarter of a million pounds if you get all six score lines completely correct. Quarter of a million pounds. That's not to be sniffed at. And this is a competition, like I say, it's completely free to enter. So there's really, there's nothing you can lose here anyway. So that's about it. So come and join us on the West Ham Massive League. As I say, you go to super6.skysports.com forward slash league. You're looking for the West Ham Massive League and the pin number you have got is all uppercase for the letters Echo Bravo 53 November 8, which I will put in the description section of this particular video. So come and join us. And uh, as well as joining us on the Super 6, if you haven't already done so, make sure you subscribe to the channel and also all of the other things besides liking this stream, comment on it in the section below if you wish, uh, subscribing to the YouTube channel, as I say, and hitting the bell icon. And don't forget to share the stream to your social media platforms. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, all these things take you only a couple of seconds to do. They're completely free of charge to you, and they help us to grow the channel from its current position. And as always, we thank you very much indeed for your support in this matter. I'm going to disappear because I say I've got my, my son's university graduation. So I'm going to bid you a fond farewell. And until the next time, come on, you Irons. And don't forget to give your support to the Irons Supporting Food Banks charity. We'll see you next time. Irons Supporting Food Banks collects food and cash donations for needy families in Newham Borough and beyond. Please consider making a donation via their Just Giving page, the link for which you will find in the description section of this stream. Come on, you Irons.